Okay, so there's been a common question um, of people asking me how I make my signs. Now, we're gonna for this example, we're gonna use this sign from Florida. Let me just X that out real quick. Um, we're not gonna focus on the exit tab, so we're just gonna focus on the main sign. But okay, so what I usually do first is that I grab text. Now I'll leave the link to everything you need to install down in the description. So let's see, long wood and winter springs. Nice. We're gonna move that up. We're not gonna completely replicate it, but we're gonna sort of get a general idea of it. Now, okay, so that's gonna be at the side. So what I do next, so I go over. I find the state root shield that I, I need I find the state root shield. Oh my god, how do I have trouble that with that one? Um now sometimes there's a direction cardinal on the real life sign, like right over here. Um so what I do after I do this is that I scroll over, I'll grab this, and then I'll paste it over here. Route 434. Cool. Now I'll get it sort of like centered. Centered. Oh my god, how to English. I cannot English at all today. You shouldn't really need to resize it, but it looks like I might need to. You know what? No, that's fine. Okay, so. Now what we need to do is that uh, we would need to find an arrow. Okay, so we go over here. We need to find the correct arrow. We need to go back over here. And then we need to throw that in. Throw it like closer. Now when you need when you resize, make sure these are the only two selected. So you might want to scale down a little bit. Alright. Let me sort of mess around with the top and side links. I'm not going to be using this sign for anything, this is just like a little sample. I'm not going to throw this anywhere. But, um, so what you want to do is that you want to grab this little, little yellow bar, depending on the exit. And then exit only, whatever arrows you want, whatever sort of fits the theme or whatever. So then you drag this all the way over here. Now you throw it a little down here. Now what you gotta do, what I, what I recommend doing, is making sure that it doesn't like, that you don't put it like that because it just looks weird. Plus I don't think they do that on the real life sign, do they? No, they don't do that. So what I generally do is I put it a little bit more down. Oh no, 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 don't do that. <laughs> um, now I'm going to sort of bring that over there. Perfect. We're going to bring the exit only over here. So now we have the perfect sign. I recommend you have a mouse for doing this because you know that would make your job way easier. And I'm not going to add the exit tab. You know what? Might as well for the episode. Um, then you go down here, select whatever exit tab you'd like. For example, I'll just select the regular sort of more blocky one. Um, sometimes you need to use the scroll bar. Sometimes you really don't. I'll just throw it up here. I don't usually do this with my signs, but you can do it if you would like. You'll just have some great space when you upload the Roblox. But okay, so 94. This sign is done. It didn't take too long, guys. Now you'll what you'll need to do is that you'll need to screenshot it however way you'd like and then upload it to your decals on Roblox. If you don't know how to upload decals on the Roblox, then I'd recommend looking at some other videos on how to do that because it's too simple. And honestly, it's just way too short to make a completely separate video on and, well, yeah. But, anyway, good comparison. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little sign making tutorial. Once again, everything you need will be down in the description. You'll have to download fonts, though, and whatnot. Um, but those will be in the sign kit folder that you'll need to download. If you need help on how to download, let me know in the comments. It'll sort of guide you through. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed. 
leave a like and subscribe if you sort of want me to make more signs and whatnot, make more videos. You know, you know the drill. But, um, anyway, I'll see you guys next video. Bye, YouTube.